getting so much fun without Hennessy. So if my first flight is any late, I might miss my second flight. We're at zero. Zero miles to empty. You can't make this shit up. We are gonna make it, I promise. What are you doing? Let's get this bread. <laughs> Is that all me? I think he's, oh, shit. I think he's still asleep. <laughs> oh, Hold on here. Dude, it's 7.30 in the morning, way too early. But it's gonna be dope, man, it's gonna be dope. We're going to Fury Tires today. I think we're starting the day. Starting the day in Houston. No, Houston. Oh, I'm all over the place. Start, starting the day in Dallas. In the day in Houston. That's what we're on right now. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know anything other than that. They didn't really tell us the itinerary. So. Let's see if we can pick up. My man had Whataburger for the first time Yo, last night. Yo, dude, I'll tell you what. That banana pudding shake absolutely slaps. Gas. Gas. I had a small, bro, and it was just more than enough. It was just perfect. A small was perfect. You think Whataburger is better than, like, In-N-Out and, and, I mean, and Five Guys? And to, oh, a, whole, a whole lot better than Five Guys. I've been to In-N-Out. It's pretty decent, but, um, yeah, Five Guys. Water, water burgers, water yeah, water burgers water up burgers there. Is five. Oh, I had, I had the sweet and spicy barbecue burger. Uh, <laughs> Yo, it was gas, gas. I'm telling you. We're about to get it out for sure. Funny part about this is we were supposed to be there at 8:30, right? It's like 8:22, 8:23, and we stroll out to the parking lot, and I think we're gonna be late. But you can see the other trucks out here in the parking lot. Who's gonna be later than us, though? We're right on time, baby. We're right on time. He told us to be there at 8:30 because there'll be breakfast provided, which makes me happy. You guys know I'm a fat boy. That's all I care about is getting breakfast. But we walk out here and there's four or five trucks sitting out here just like us. That's all I'm saying. It's actually half an hour early. Half, half an hour early, exactly. I tell her says 9 a.m. <laughs> Look, Sutton out here. Yep, okay. That ain't a surprise. How much fireball did you get into last night, Sutton? God damn. Oh, we caught him just in time. There I was talking shit. He's beating us. Other than Sutton, though, we got Sutton beat. For the, for the content, you know? Bro, shout out. This is gonna be a yeah, shout out to my boy from LSX Media for the pizza. I'm gonna try, Bro. I'm fucking hungry. Which one we- From last night. Which one we greasing on? Let's let's try it. Let's get this one so I can get a little pepperoni on it. A little cold pizza hey, action, the pepperoni. Bro, cold pizza action is definitely the wave. Cold pizza cold. gangster. Rate it, one through 10. Brush shit kind of hitting though, for real. <laughs> it's like it's like doughy on the bottom. Cheese is kind of thick. Little little pepperoni cups. Little little pepperoni nipples up there. You know what I mean? Eight and a half. Eight and a half, Alex. What do you think? I'm going eight, eight and a half. Yeah. That's, eight and a half. Yeah. Shit, that's a solid rating to start off the morning. Yeah. If this bitch was hot, probably nine, nine and a half. Dude, how we lose our filmer? Where'd he go? Y'all gotta try that shit. No, I'm gonna try that shit. I should have told y'all it was ass, so you didn't eat any. I can have all of it. Now I just hopping on? If you know me, I'm not a fan of pizza. Definitely the wave, cold pizza. That's not seven, bad. Seven, eight out of ten, I'll be. Seven, eight out of ten, bro. Oh. Damn. Come on, get you one. Dude. All right. Oh, no. Fire. It's not bad. Bro, no. it reminds me of the Cuban pizza they got down in Miami. Oh, bro, no fire. That's what I'm saying. It's like soft and like. Damn. That's a hit. That's a hit. It's definitely a appreciate hit. Appreciate you, my boy. Shout out to the sex media. Yeah, appreciate you, my boy. Slammer. I'm about to film a whole episode just of food reviews this morning. There is a Riz review? You know, morning, morning food review. We're gonna get some refreshments, right? Where's the chocolate milk at? Oh, that's a bit. Chocolate milk. Where's the chocolate milk at? <laughs> Sean Miller, if you're watching this, you better come pick me up from the goddamn airport Sunday night, and we better go get some chocolate milk. That's all I'm saying. Good chocolate I'm milk. I'm holding you to it, Sean. I got you with the chocolate oh, milk. Yep, 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 yep. What's the move? What's the move? Yep. Got it. Bag secured. What are y'all? Are y'all? What? Are, what are we? True Moo? Are you a, a YooHoo fan or Nesquik? Given the choice, given the choices, normally the Borden is the move. Um, I'm a big Publix chocolate milk fan, but Nesquik is always a good go-to. Always. Fiji. Yeah, for real. She has 
You must drink boss water too. No, that's disgusting. Yeah, it's very wow. Look, Maria, if you're watching this, cheers. Cheers, Maria. <laughs> cheers. What kind of water are we feeling today? Bro, what kind of water are we feeling today? I'm a smart water kind of guy. Kids, Just in like, case y'all were wondering. Carolina boy kind of kids came up. Hey, bro, that thing's sick. Where are you guys from? Blah, blah, blah. They're like, bro, is that the giveaway company? They're like, I don't know, no. But no. I swear. I've got it on video that we are making it work. We 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 left and it we walked in and it didn't look like this. That's all I'm saying. I'm gonna shit. Okay. Yeah. Let's just let's just go. Um, yeah. We're walking out of the gas station and I kind of got excited. They were standing over there waiting to get in the truck and I yelled, "Let's get this bread out of him!" It's top at the top of my lungs and I scared some guy walking by. I feel bad. What happened, bro? Yep. Yeah, First stop of the day, still in Dallas. We were at the KG1 headquarters yesterday, so we're all the wheels ship out of. Today we're at the Fury headquarters in Dallas, and that's the first stop of the day. Get something to eat, get everybody together, throw some last minute decals on the trucks, detail everything, even though I feel like it's gonna rain. O was telling me that it's almost like a like a pump fake that it's gonna rain every day, but it doesn't. But I really do feel like it might rain looking at the, the sky back there. But I think we're getting great weather, great weather. I, think, I weather. think it's gonna rain a little bit, but I hope not. that'll make for good content. I'm you know? tired of this rain. It'll make for good no, content. No, I'm tired of the rain. Trust the I live in Florida. No, that ah, is not okay, part okay. of the process. I feel that, that is not part of the process. I came process. out here to you see wash some your car, You wash your car and 10 minutes later it's, I, I came it's soaked in wet. Because I wanted to see some cactuses. Cactuses in Texas. Texas. Damn, that's a good idea. It's cactuses. a good combination, right? Good I don't combo. think I can put we're that in we're, the video. We're offside tonight. Cactus, Stop number one at Fury cactuses, today, though. Stop baby. number one. Fury, let's get this bread. Players, the bumper ones? Yeah. These? That's the only difference. Why do I... Why? I already got a taco. I feel like all I do is eat on this channel anymore. All you do is eat. Bacon, egg. Yeah. There ain't no cheese on there. I should have got cheese, but bacon, egg. You're not going to get you one? I'm going to get me one now. I'm just waiting for the review. That white bow tie review. It's good. It's gas. I feel like I don't say anything trash on the table. Yeah, I, mean, you, I mean, usually when you smile, we already know it's good. Like, that's just the key. I'm just hungry all the time, bro. That's what it is. <laughs> I need to start posting on my Chef Bow Tie channel. Y'all want to see some videos on the Chef Bow Tie channel? Drop a comment below. We'll start doing food reviews and stuff only on that channel. I should, that's what I should do. Start a food review channel. There you go, bro. I'm only in, I'm only in Texas for a couple days. I got to eat as much as possible. I got to get the, get the feel of Texas, you know what I mean? But would your food review be like, let's taste this bread, maybe? Let's, uh, let's get this bread? I don't know, but shit's gas, is all I'm saying. Let's taste this bread. I like that slogan. Let's taste this bread. Let's taste this bread. <laughs> Let's taste it. Yeah. You know, it it's tastes. tastes this lie's got to be so difficult. It's nice. <laughs> it's all right, lies. Get here when you can. Just get here when you can, lies. It's okay. Is that what this is? NDA? <laughs> Does it say we can't post That's what I got my eye for. It says no booty hole. Uh, no booty hole pictures? Just no. That's unfortunate. What are we signing? I uh, guess you know, no booty hole. put Orlando. Uh, I'll, I'll write it out, bro. <laughs> if, like if you're from trip. Miami, you know we do things last minute. We're filming and a poor citizen. Alex, what? Can't be my last name. Are, you, are you? I've never had to sign paperwork to film something before. Never, you never filmed for Casting Couch? 
<laughs> that was a good one, actually. Make me fill out a ton of paperwork. Not, I'm not gonna lie. For casting couch? <laughs> for LA pipe. How was that experience? It was good. I told her it wasn't good. Until she whooped out a dick that was bigger than mine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, O said you signed, you signed, right? Read the paperwork. <laughs> <laughs> Better read the fine print, huh? We're gonna be heading out soon, so I'm gonna give you guys a quick rundown of the trucks that are out here with us today. If you guys didn't watch the most recent video, I'm gonna run through them real quick with you guys one time. Shout out to Josh from Max Diesel. We got Josh's 450 out here on the max diesel wheels he's got all kinds of stuff done to this one on a striker lift we got mariah's truck on 30s and 42s with the air ride kit we got lifted ripper with the orange or sorry i'm gonna say orange yellow on 30s and 42s we got the blue camo any level lift 30s and 42s this one's really cool love the wrap on this one love the wrap on both of those as well the uh the salmon color and the yellow is just super bright and just you're gonna notice it anywhere you go we got the 450 tow pig on 26s and fury ats one of my personal favorites you got the tan 2020 Ford High Country on the FTS kit, which is super nice. We're going to look at this one a little bit more later. Got Laz's 250 on the 26s and the Poppy's Lift F-150. And then my personal favorite down there on the end that we'll look at a little bit later. It's just fire like when they get... It's 945 Sutton. 945. It's okay. Just get here when you can. It's all right. Fury Tires headquarters. Look over back to the left, you see a good lineup of tires that we can walk through. Everything from our ATs, RTs, MT1s, and MT2s, and all sorts of sizes. So the first stop today, obviously, is here at Fury HQ. We got some tacos for you, some coffee. Obviously, you can grab a tire, any of the stuff, energy drinks up top. Help yourselves. Um, this will be the first day where we're actually driving, and the first stop will be down in Austin, Texas. So we're all gonna link up at the Bucky's down 35 West, we'll link up there, get everyone together, and then roll out. You can't want it today. I still want to be able to be. You're still going the same speed. <laughs> So we got 
got about a five mile window that I don't know what's gonna happen. And I'm really hoping you're not lying about the 10 miles an hour no, but, or the 10 I, miles extra. I, I, I test this all the time. You gotta realize we're in Texas at like a 500 mile road trip. Sometimes there's no gas stations. So, really? Not really, but it, it, you know. Or when you get on the west side. When you're out west Texas, it gets lonely. I don't wanna go there. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Got a lot of places to go hunting. We want to go there. Three miles. Ten feet. Hey, but there's one thing I can say. I don't piss excellence anymore. No. I cut it off. He cut. He yeah yeah. I'm, so y'all know this is my first. This is my first YouTube video without the mullet. Actually. Really? It's my first YouTube video without the mullet. Just cut the mullet Same. off. I'm going to get it faded up next week. I know it looks like trash. His hair is looking a lot better than mine right now. And I literally show up yesterday and had no idea he cut the mullet off. And we look at each other like Spider-Man. Like, right. you know the I mean? Like, right. like, no fucking, just, like, you cut yours, didn't tell me. I cut mine, didn't tell Yeah. You know, I gave the trend to Morgan Wallen, you know. Hey, yeah. <laughs> I thought about buzzing mine after that, but I'm not going to. I, I couldn't do the, I couldn't do the buzz cut. Anyway, we're getting distracted here. Hold on. I'm sorry. Oh, we're, we're, miles, still, we're, still, we're still, we're still three. We got, we got, hey, we're, we're making up some. We're making up some. Time. Six point eight miles yeah. to three miles. The math ain't math in here, is all I'm saying. The math is mathin', just in a different way. Two miles, it's empty. Uh, hey, we're gonna make it. I'm gonna update you when it gets to zero. <laughs> One mile to empty. Still got five miles. Still to got go. five miles to go. Let's get this bread. Send it. You know what uh, the number zero and a bread loaf have in common? They're both round. Just throwing that out there. I'm just waiting for it to hit zero. I'm excited, hey, actually. You know what me and the number zero have in common? What? Uh, I have zero dollars in my wallet. Zero dollars in your wallet. Zero miles in your gas tank. Luckily, I got a card for that, so we're good. What we're happens pushing. when it hits zero? I don't know. It, does just, it, just, it just says zero. Does it just hit zero? Yeah. Or does it like blink and, and make a big fuss? Or I mean, it, it, oh, it, there it goes. Zero. It makes a fuss. We're at zero. Zero miles to empty. You can't make this shit up. I would love for somebody to say this is fake. Same Even like though we're passing gas stations right now. We're literally passing a gas station. Oh, how must it be nice to be getting gas right now. <laughs> zero miles to empty. We're going to make it. We are gonna make it, I promise. If we don't, we got 10 trucks around us, so we're good. Oh, yeah. Which is why I'm not really freaking out, but. I, I'm, yeah, well, I'm kind of freaking out because I don't want it to crawl up there and, if we have to prime the lines because, you know, I'm the dumbass that'll sit there and try to push it to the gas station and start it again and keep going. Is, and that, get a diesel, is that a diesel thing having to prime the gas on the Because you run all the gas out of the lines or something? You mean diesel? diesel? What did I say? Diesel? I, you said gas. Gas, sorry. Diesel is what God. I mean. I probably said gas there too and made you say gas. <laughs> we don't know. But the problem is, is that if you do run air through your lines, you will have to bleed them and then fire it back up with your injector lines cracked. Well, let's, not on this, but not on a Cummins. But let's not do that. This thing, it should prime itself. Just keep talking. The, 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 the talking take, distracts our mind. From the I, the, the thing is, is that I know, like, I'm looking forward <laughs> talking and I still see that big ass zero. Like, I don't you know you just feel like you're fucking doing something right and you're really not because you're at zero miles of empty oh they're getting they're getting over wait is wait. that a good thing oh yes because there's Bucky's side right there I don't see it you see it right there no left side I don't see it there. Not, see that. not a, a shot. That's a big sign. Not a shot that I see that. Oh, you're talking about that one right there. Okay, yeah. Right there. Yes. I see it. We, zoom in on that bad boy so they know. They can't. It doesn't zoom that far, but. Gosh, we need to get you a better lens. Yeah, trash. Right there. I'm pointing at it. Right there. The circle. Right there. Were all those lights on the dash before? No? I uh, Well, uh, no. When you lift a truck. <laughs> You don't have half the sensors that need to be on the truck, like you know. The you have lights on the dash. Look, we're getting off the interstate. We are, yes, we are definitely getting fuel, and some drinks, and going to Austin. We still have about maybe another hour forty-five to get to Austin from here. So, so another two-hour ride. Uh, they're slow pokes back then. Well, you know, if we have to deal with they like, may Andy have a two hour ride and Josh. 
rush and which we understand, you know. They're, they, they're built for aggressive and not. Yeah. Mine show. is built for uh, a little bit of everything because the man that built it won my diesel performance. Shout yeah. out. Shout out. Definitely shout out. If you want to see some cool ass builds, that's where to go. But uh, they built my shit to go fast and it's not meant to go fast. And then I blow a lot of shit up and then we have problems like my transmission overheating and shit that's like fun. that. And, and then we have the problem with me running out of fuel quicker yeah. than I should be. Yeah, we yeah. So the good news is the Bucky sign is here. And we've got about two or three hundred yards to make it. We are now in Temple, Texas. Hello, Temple. The old Temple. Where was that Starbucks this morning when I fucking needed it? We had Starbucks on the table when we had breakfast. Yeah, nobody's drinking that hot and trash. It's Starbucks? Let me rephrase this. I like like two drinks from Starbucks, okay? Let me guess all the energy drinks, like the lemonade, the no, no, lemonade. No, 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 no. I get ice and latte. And dragon fruit or whatever. La ice latte. Called. I've never tried any of the refreshments. Ice latte. Hey, ice latte. I will give it their lemonade perfect. Son, that shit smacks. <laughs> Dude. That shit smacks. I will get white girl fucking wasted on some fucking lemonade from Starbucks. Does it go to negative one at some point or no? No, no, it stays at zero. Okay. And then at an incline right now that we're at, we might run out, but we should make I have, it. I have faith. I have faith. We should make it. We, we definitely should make it. We made it, we made it. I'm not gonna lie, I can't believe we made that. at Bucky's, biggest Bucky's I've ever seen in my entire life. We got a couple of them in Georgia, but pulling up to somewhere as busy as this with all these trucks is a freaking nightmare. What up? What up? So only your second time at Bucky's? Bucky's is a nice place. Honestly, why does Walmart even exist when you have Bucky's? And why does 7-Eleven not try this hard? They have backpacks, lunch boxes, more backpacks, coolers. They get more stuff in stock than Walmart in general. And then you got this guy. Dude, what are you going to buy here, bro? Dude, you realize I live here, right? Oh, he lives here. All right, man. So, like, I see this stuff all the time. Dude, like, this place is You want the best cooler? Come on. Come on. I'll show, you. I'll show you. Dude, Bucky's remember I'm this. They're going to put Waller out of business, bro. They already did. Yeah, got gotcha. you. I don't like Wally you. World. But the Yukon Outfitter stuff, these coolers. Fire oh, shit. Fire Dude, I, when I'm hunting, that's all I use. Really? Fire. Throw it in the Jeep, it doesn't get hurt, nothing. Good to yeah. go. No, it's nice. It's a nice. And night. the zippers aren't as hard as the Yetis. You heard it first. Kind of need one. You heard it first. Oh, dude, this is kind of a come up too. These are not as big as the other guys. What do you need to go to Summit Racing for? Summit Racing, bro. Yeah. Bucky's has Ar everything. Bucky's has bro. everything. What the hell? RJ's. It's the shit. Bucky's has everything. <laughs> Boosies, get it right. Boosies. <laughs> Me and mom are grocery shopping. Oh, what'd you get today? What did we get? I got everything underneath the sun. <laughs> like, I'm ready to eat. Stomach of steel over here. Always. Always. Stomach of steel. What did you get? Oh, nothing. That's no fun. Okay. Look at this guy over here. He's going inside, buddy. It's hot outside. That guy over there. What's up, bro? Right, we're doing the BLT, bacon, lettuce, tomato, turkey, the turkey BLT from Bussies. They give you a whole salsa cup of ketchup, though. Mm-hmm. That bitch is gas. That's actually not bad. Turkey. Hey, they ain't, they ain't bad. 
being a fat kid today, we got some cookie dough and some banana pudding too. Yeah, keep. So we made it to the uh, we made it to the F1 circuit of Americas just outside of Austin, Texas. We're gonna be doing some uh, kart racing today. Never done this day before in my life. Never been to Texas. I don't really know what to expect. We got the lineup outside. We got all the 450s on that side and everybody else on this side. Shout out to KG1 and Fury for the invite to the uh, to the event today. It's for the weekend. We're gonna go race some karts. Like I said, you can hear the the bikes, the Ducatis in the background racing around. I wish I could get some drone shots, but they told us that we're not allowed to film drones or anything out here. So I'm gonna get as much filming done as I can. And hopefully get some shots me in the cart but like I said we're gonna race some carts and then we're, we're gonna end the night in uh, Austin tonight downtown Austin I, I think they told us we're gonna stay some, somewhere down there tonight I, I don't know what the deal is I'm just along for the ride so let's go race some carts have some fun let's get this bread John Gerard, that's his name. I'm John Gerard today. Hey, can you guys yeah, put the camera just... down and enjoy? Look at John, John Gerard over here. Keep walking, bud. Keep walking, bud. I don't like your, uh, I don't like your energy right now. I need you to pipe down over there. Listen, I need some wheels and tires. Can I get some wheels and tires? Call me on Monday. You, you work at Southern Tires? Call me on Monday. Can I, get, I need it's, some 30s. Call me on Monday. But we're going I won't to fucking SEMA. be there. Call me on Monday. I won't hey, fucking be there. It's holiday. The Pino? Look at this place. Oh, this is cool. Tell me how you feeling right now. <laughs> like motherfucking pop smoke. <laughs> like that goddamn woo. Shout out to little baddie. See my little boo thing. Nah, nah, nah my, favorite, my, favorite line, my favorite pop smoke line is uh. Okay, well, well, well. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Sammy. All right, all right. Back, 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 back to my favorite pop smoke line is uh. I'm a thief, I'm a thief of the night. I'm a thief of the night, Shoney. What? Are we supposed to wear the socks on our head? I don't know, man. I gave that life up a long time ago. Well, how long ago? <laughs> nah, I'm just trying to be a good kid with a YouTube channel. I'm not you don't. But I keep that thing on me. He's retired. He's retired. I keep that thing on He's me. He's retired. Sneak and geek. Snatch and grab. Snatch and run. Sniper gang, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Everywhere you put it, I must you with it. <laughs> yes. Just look at your car. Yeah, 
is how you really hit them. <laughs> oh, actually, I got it. Prepared for anything. Oh, they're not going up. Ah, I don't believe you. <laughs> Shoot the camera on what? On me, bro. I love being behind the lens. What you talking about? And we all sign with it. You see the vibes. So it's usually dirty hands, clean money. But today, we're really going to hop on the freight train. Freight train don't stop. We're at Circuit of the Americas here in Austin, Texas. I'm here with my homie Alex, that white bow tie. My shooter, original. Look, another he, shooter. He another shooter. Ass kicked on Terry. Mm. Man, why they talk so much shit? I got, I got my boy Sutton over here. He looks nice and calm and relaxed. He's nice and collected. That man looks like he's been racing before. But anyways, we're outside. We're headed to the track. Shout out to KG1 and Fury. This is a super, super sick event. You going? You going first? No, I'm not. We're, we're in the first race. Maybe let's get his breath. Yeah. Dang. Live my life with you. Number 19 today. 19. So we had we had a good week of practice. We had some good test laps. We're not sitting on the pole this week, but uh, I, th I think it's gonna be a good day racing. As long as we can have some quick pit stops, I think we'll make it work today. So All right, fine. What's, what pit. number are you? Uh, as long as Laz don't spin me out, fuck him. What number are you? 19. Yeah, All right, fine. 19. Fine. Everything I'm on Everything I do is fuck. Got the pins jumping out the bag. Another milestone, look at that. Paper boy, I'm a paper route, till I'm six down on my back. I'm an old soul like my dad. My old girl's still a fan. The yo girl at the live show, so don't act like I ain't the man. I'm kicking my feet up, get frank like Aretha. I'm calm, but I'm teed up, just flip me a stack. The re up just doubled up off of the muscle, I stuck to the task. They see me, I'm troubled, I'm bubbling up till it's stuck, and they want me to stay where I'm at. I'm good everywhere that I'm stepping, my presence is crucial. You know that this shit, not no trend. On a big wave, I'm controlling the tide. Snake eyes when you rolling the dice. So with the stakes inside, I connect. No! Never take another nigga advice. They can't reach the sky, I'm aiming up high. I just wanna know what it's like. Y'all know what it's like, I come from my side of this. Out the quicksand, on the big man, doing big things. Come a big change, up a state lines, doing stage dives. We finished up the races. Such a good time. Thank you to KG1 and Fury for the opportunity. But it wouldn't be an opportunity if we didn't go check out the F1 track. No, they put the motorcycles on there. Yeah, they left a little while ago. You think I can hop on the car? Oh, he has the same idea. <laughs> Motorcycle tracks. Dude, I think they do car racing here too, F1 stuff. Dude, absolute sick. I should have got some fun there. You hop on one of those or what? Motorcycle? No, absolutely not. Dude, I need Absolutely not. Oh, the whole team is gonna be here. Now we look like douchebags. Look, look. Looks like somebody did a little burnout down here because they won. Oh. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Do a burnout or don't show up. Yeah, this is double. We just finished up racing go-karts over here, which was such an amazing time. We're not allowed to film as much as I would have wanted to because some of this might be picked up by one of the bigger networks, Netflix, Hulu, one of, you know, one of those like that. Um, definitely a good time. I'm gonna throw some clips in there for you guys to see. Truck of the day, 100%. I've been waiting towards the end of the video to show you guys this truck, and I've been waiting for this one for months and months and months. Andy with Fury has finally got his 2023 refreshed front end Chevy Silverado 1500 finished up, and I'm, uh, Excited is an understatement. Excited to show you guys this truck today. Not only did it get dropped off to him tonight and it hasn't been cut yet, so it's not 100% done. Just the fact that I'm all the way out in Texas for the first time really spending time in Texas and I'm able to show you guys this truck and just give you guys some good old that wide bow tie content even when I'm out of town is just super special to me. So we got this 2023 GMC Denali. Um, GMC Denali. We've been doing a lot of Denalis at the, at the shop, I guess. 2023 refreshed front end Chevy 1500 Z71. Got the new front end on it all the 2023s obviously are all going to have the new front end which i absolutely love i've grown to love it it's just my my favorite body style now other than maybe the 14 that i have seven to nine inch mcgoy's lift kit you know you know you know we got to show love out here to the mcgoy's kits best seven to nine inch mcgoy's lift kit for the chevy 1500s other than the fts but i'm still rocking with my guys over there at mcgoy's over fts 2414 kg1 tonic brand new wheel from kg1 in the all gloss black he's got the metal center caps and them bitches 
spin too. Got them really nice floating center caps on there. All gloss black, gloss black lug nuts. Really just nice clean setup. 2414 Tonic, one of their newest wheels. I think there's the two, these are one of the two newest designs that are on the website right, right now. And KG1's newest tire, 35, 35, 16, 50, 24. This is definitely something I may have to upgrade to. 35, 16, 50, 24. So I don't have to upgrade to a 405 to still do 16 wides on a 24, 14. I don't have to do 26, 16 even though I really want to. But that 35, 16, 50 gives it the same profile as what a 375. You got just enough sidewall so you're not messing up and hitting curbs, but it still gives it that just super wide. Like, look at that. Look at that wheel in the back. Look how fat that is back there. Outside of the 405 with 26s for 24-inch wheels, this is my favorite tire that Fury has on the market right now. Hands down, no questions asked. 35, 16, 50, 24 with the 24, 14. I may not, like I said, I may not even have to go to 26s. I may be able to run this and get the exact look that I'm looking for on the truck away from the Nittos. He upgraded the upper control arms. We're still waiting on the face plates for that. Still waiting on the polished face plates for the front compression struts. He's missing one of the McGoy's logos on the front and we're missing the billet face places on the back. Now, like I said, the truck is not 100% done yet. So there are a bunch of little just details that are going to get touched up, but you know, you got to add the traction bars to the kit. You know, you got to add the upper control arms to the kit. All the face plates are just a bonus. They look so, it just gives the lift kit just that little bit more of a show truck look that I love so much. 24, 14, 35, 16, 50s, 9 inch McGoy's lift. You guys know it's my favorite setup of all time. You know I'm going to build a truck like this at some point. No better way to end day one of the Lifted Legends rally than to show you guys a brand new McGoy's lift 24, 14s. Fury and KG1's newest wheel and tire combo. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. You guys know the vibes. Let's get this bread, baby. What you want is it really that important? You've been on my mind and I really can't ignore it. Little baby, you a 10. When I'm in it, I got you going, oh. I can't even help it. I don't think I want to know that I That will conclude day one of the Lifted Legends Rally. If you guys are liking the content so far, make sure you guys hit the like button, hit the subscribe button for all the beautiful trucks behind me. If you guys would like more content like this, like and subscribe. I love you guys so much. Let's get this bread. Get this bread baby. That's what I'm talking about.